Knocking point, friends. What's happening? Don't mind me. I'm just pretending that I'm Carrie Elways from the first act of Princess Bride. <clears throat> or I'm being tortured in the Arrow flashbacks. Which one is it? I don't know. It is Friday night, March 31st. You are seeing this on April 1st, and I can assure you this is not an April Fool's joke. Zacho actually pitched that we do an April Fool's joke, and, and, and we were like, no, we're, we're not going to. Anyway, awesome things are happening with Knocking Point. Believe it or not, it is time already to start thinking about the June 1st wine club shipment. Why are we starting so early? Well, first and foremost, we have awesome stuff to reveal. Uh, I'm going to be doing a label reveal today. We're going to do another label reveal next week. And then, after that, we are going to be announcing our very first collaboration. I will speak more about that at the end of the video. But, oh my god, it's exciting. Hella exciting. I've never used that word before in a sentence. Hopefully that was the last time. So, the reason that we're starting so early is because uh, Knocking Point now being the uh, uh, nimble, fast-growing company that it is, we want to let more people into the wine club. We grew it by leaps and bounds from our December 1st shipment to our March 1st shipment, and from our March 1st shipment to our June 1st shipment, based on all the cool news that I'm going to give you, we would like to grow it again. Because we have wonderful partners, and they are nimble on their feet, and they can fulfill our orders up to a certain point. So, long story short, the waitlist is open, there is a link attached, it's the best wine club on the planet. Straight up. Best wine club on the planet. And today, we are going to talk about the wine that, until a Melbeck rolled along, I think was the wine that we are known for. And my proclivity and uh, Drew's proclivity for Rosé, it's becoming the stuff of legends. Pink wine for dudes. It's year four of Apex Rosé. It was named Apex because of a photo that our buddy Nick took of Drew and I high-fiving. Little known fact, both of us have 65-inch verticals. I'm, don't shoot the messenger, I'm just here to tell you. So, uh, originally it was just the two of us high-fiving, and then it turned into a piece of art, and now we, um, we're expanding on that theme. The back label is never going to change, it's always going to say pink wine for dudes, but the front label is changing a little bit, more on that in a second. Sean Boyd, this is a French-inspired rosé, it is really good, drink it cold, drink it in the morning. Sorry, drink it at any point of the day is probably when it's best. Danny Haas nailed it again for us this year. Here we go. The label reveal. Aprex Rosé. Just two dudes high-fiving in space. Where will it be next year? Top of Mount Everest. Um, uh, uh, on stage at a Drake concert. Really, uh, the possibilities are endless. In fact, you know what I would like to do now that I think of it off the top of my head? I would like to high five um, right above the famous water tower on the Warner Brothers lot. So I'll work on getting that approved, um, you know, as, as all things with major uh, film and television studios. No lawyers will be involved. It'll be a uh, slam dunk. So we're very excited for Apex Rosé. We're very excited at the State of the Wine Club and everything that is happening with Knocking Point between the goods, between all the parties that we have coming up, between the new format of the party that we did in Chicago, where, uh, you know, more panels, uh, more Q&A with the audience. I thought it went swimmingly. Uh, we got a great team that's working for us now, between Sarah and Jamie the Wolf and Zacho, Drew and I, uh, Cass and Jen. By the way, Cass loves that I love this picture. And just know that deep in my heart, it makes me very happy that I married Miss Corpus Christi. And uh, that's it. Thank you to Sean Boyd. Thank you to Danny Haas. Apex Rosé, our fourth installment, will be in the June 1st Wine Club shipment. And there is a link attached. You should join. Again, I'm not being... I'm not... Bo well, I am boasting, but I'm also right. Best wine club in the world. We will be releasing the label for Maha next week, and then someone else will probably do a video because a very good friend of ours, and I think a very good friend of yours, um, collaborated with us. It's very exciting. They are very exciting. Talk to you soon.